here is a PowerPoint which is recorded with audio. As you can tell, when I click on the speaker icon for this, it starts to play an audio clip, which you could hear if you were wearing headphones or had this on speakers. All of the slides have audio, and as you can see, the size is 4.78 megabytes, but you can reduce the size even further by clicking Compress Media and reduce it, let's say, to internet quality. And the action of compressing the media will start to process the audio files. And this can take a while, so we shall pause and then come back when it's almost finished. The file is just about completely compressed. and the compression is complete and so when you close the file and then you could save it but I would save it as a new copy I would save it as a different file so I'm going to call this file 2 just for simplicity's sake and then when I go back to check its size it's now 2.9 megabytes which is roughly half the size of what the file was in actuality when you add audio to a PowerPoint slide it may be as much as 70 80 90 megabytes in size and using the compress media command will get it down to a size which you can then upload to your assignment Dropbox in Canvas or attach to an email in any manner you see fit which will transport that file to its destination.